What we got going on today? Candied yams. Oh yeah. See, Thanksgiving's on its way. You need to get this ready. Get this recipe. Let's go. All right, so first thing you want to do is you want to get the oven at 400 degrees and you're going to put these sweet potatoes. You want to put aluminum foil on the pan because they will they are going to get sticky. It's going to bleed out a little bit. And once it gets completely cooked, it takes about 30, 45 minutes to do so, but it's going to be very soft. Now, you want to do this when it cools down a little bit because it is hot. So um, I'm just going to cut these in small little, little cubes. And we're gonna use this as our first layer. Um, we're gonna layer it at the bottom. Now, I love this. This goes great with a lot of different things, but Thanksgiving, this is perfect for Thanksgiving. Uh, now, once we get that done, we're gonna take some white sugar um, or brown sugar. Mainly, you could use a lot of brown sugar, and the reason why brown sugar is even better because it has a molasses to it, but I was really, really short on brown sugar, so excuse me. I used a little bit of white sugar and I used some brown sugar, but I didn't have enough uh, brown sugar like I usually use, so I used white and brown. We're gonna tap it up with a little bit of cinnamon, 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 and we also got some nutmeg that's coming on top of this. Now you can add a little bit of cloves. This actually gives an extra layer of flavor and a little nutmeg. And what you can do with this is you're gonna put you can put a lid over this and literally put this in the oven. Now I add a little bit of vanilla extract also into this. So it's actually actually I love having flavored candy yams. We're gonna put some butter on here, uh, put it on top of it. So I don't know if you even like candy yams, but you know, I love candy yams. Candy yams are a, a staple at our house, especially on Thanksgiving. Sometimes we do it on Christmas also, but you gotta have some candy yams. So you know, I'm putting a little bit of foil over here, put it right on top, and then we're gonna put it right into the oven. Now, this is already cooked. It doesn't need to be in there too long. Probably about a good 10, 15 minutes. Uh, the longer you let it sit in there, you know, you're just kind of letting it steam and letting the, uh, the sugar caramelize a little bit so it doesn't take too long we're gonna undo it and now i did put some marshmallows right on top of this it looks perfect right now now you can leave it as it is i put a little bit of salt right here um because i forgot to put the salt in earlier and you want to take some marshmallows and put them right on top of there now you can actually take the marshmallows right here and then put it on the broiler and just put it in the broiler and let it cook down. I made the mistake actually putting this dang on lid back on there, which I shouldn't have done because what happened was it actually exploded and it got bigger. So uh, don't do that. I re had to redo it as you can see the edges on there, but it came out perfect. Let me know what you think on this recipe. And hey, please don't forget to put a like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Help me out with the algorithm. And let's get it going. All right. Talk to y'all later. Bye.